Thank you. Hold on, let's get your chair. Let's get your chair. I'd rather get straight. Last night's out. You said, let me get me out of this room. Let's get your chair. 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 Oh, I can. Yeah. <laughs> I, I can tell you that we find out that there's a lot more play than we're currently aware of. There are some people working behind the scenes for a variety of shady reasons, and they come from all areas. And all the different heroes of the show don't recognize that these people are hopping on in here and figuring things out. Coming on in, planning little things on the side, trying to screw Alec over. That's what the show's about. Like a Philip screw. How do you screw Alec over? That's what the show's about. How do we the, make the, the whole intention of the show is to screw Alec over? Yeah. That's a, that's yeah. Yeah. if you're seeing it, that's what you should look forward to. Yeah. Seeing this guy just like you. trying to figure yeah. out how to get out yeah. of this situation. <laughs> that's right. representation and uh, I think this just seeing two completely different worlds but I think that I think that there's one thing about both the characters they they we say this a lot but they put walls up right and I think that a lot of people who are hiding from themselves really are defined are defined in that way by putting those walls up and I think that some people try to act out a little bit like you know Magnus is kind of hiding himself by hiding in plain sight by putting on peacock feathers and uh, distracting from the other things that cause misery to him and a lot of us do that peacock feathers. I mean, that's what he's doing he's wearing all his old peacocked up he's wearing all the shiny stuff and Alec is putting himself in this little bubble of hiding from what he uh, can't really truly hide from and but he tries to as much as possible I think people relate to that and then for those people to find each other bring those walls down that's the dream that's the ideal I think that's where this comes from, and hopefully we can see more Being of Being your uh, true authentic selves with to another, each other. yeah. Yes. So he, is he enjoying being a leader at this point? Alec? Yeah. I think Alec is always a leader, and I think just giving the title, and I think this title is a little bit of like, a, what would the equivalent be from like a kangaroo court? It's just, he's not actually in charge of much. The, the, the position has changed more often than it's got turnover like a startup company in New he's, York. It's, he's, it's, he's like the, the JV assistant coach. Yeah, you know who's now I mean? been put briefly in charge because they had to fire the previous coaches. It's, it's I want this a, to happen. He's no, you still can't in do that. Okay. You know? I, would I mean, he was on the job for three days before there was a question on him getting fired from the job. And that's like, come on. Come on, that's a ridiculous You system. control like the schedule and stuff? No, you don't have to control anything. Also, when by the way, this is, this is a big problem with the Clave. The Clave thinks that it's an organization. It's not an organization. You don't fire your CEO every three every three weeks. This is not a good way of running yeah, anything. Isn't it a non-profit organization? It's not a non-profit. It's, no, no, <laughs> it's a political, kind of it's a a semi-political military organization that's operating from a four-way uh, organizational location and trying to establish businesses in each in each city. It's, it's outrageous. How do you make your money? How do you? How do they profit? Right. I think no, they're doing they have investors. Other, oh, other, other, other. You think this is a Ponzi scheme? Well, no, other millionaires are, are uh, shadow hunters too. But you think they're investing? In, no, I think it's running like a government. Percentage tax of your income, income. And, and when you're a shadow hunter, you give a percentage. I think of your we need income. to start talking about how they're. They're not trading being on the market. On the on the what are the, the on the very the Magnus is um, very. So no far. one's dipping into the church donation zone. So. Magnus has a lot of paintings that he has sold. Oh over yeah. Here. No, that's how Magnus. That's not the play. You're smart about that. You're independently. You're independently wealthy. I think that we're doing. I think you know what I think we might be doing. I think we might be taking some of the bodies that we, the things we've killed. We take, for example, werewolves. We take their fingernails. We take the teeth, and then we we oh, yeah, hoard those items. We categorize them, and we we put them into 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 complex markets where we begin to sell them. And I think that we probably. I think it's gotten really far and really deep. I think we're talking. I think we're talking subprime mortgage kind of situation here. And I think it's very likely that uh, the plate is going to collapse financially in the near future, which will lead to absolute man. Well, what happens to all the categorized werewolf claws and yeah, yeah, but higher quality, different kinds. Yeah, I mean, they get sold off. 
Demand himself, the sellers are the... I have, uh, you know, Magnus is a lot of them. Magnus is and stuff. You have a market for them. I'm just learning all this. Oh, no, there's a whole thing. Okay, next question. Okay, okay. Uh, well, okay. You guys, uh, your characters. Malik seems to have, like, most stable relationships in the, the, the show right now. So what would your characters be? Yeah. Yo, stop fucking around. Okay. 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 No, but for, for but for Luke, need to start. Start fucking around. around. That's right. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Yeah, don't let your okay. love interest die. Yeah, you got. Okay. You, 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 you go, you're on the other spectrum. You need to like start right. shifting in the middle. Right. And be like, yo, who wants to get up in there? Right. You need yeah. to cause some drama somewhere. I'm yeah. You. <laughs> you know, need to get up in the mix. That show that we have. No, so many more, please. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, it, it all it falls down like a house of cards. You know what I mean? Like Luke, Luke realizes, like, what? Well, I can only do so much. You know what I mean? Clary's not listening to me. Simon only listens to me when he needs something. These two, they got their own. No, that's not try, try to work with you, and then you try to go she kill my it. prisoner. <laughs> Yo, yeah, Magnus he, tried to talk he, sense to you because you were trying no, to go. But you, you wait, no, but he talked AWOL. sense to I, you. I, I you were losing. He did you talk your damn mind. Uh, yeah. So now that's in tonight's uh, and, 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 and Monday. Yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. So you're gonna see him trying to talk some sense into him, and that's not gonna work. The only then, one that makes any sense here is. But he's like, I can't me. be bothered, man. I, can, I can't. I can't. I just. It's, it's, and then, but then you have payback because then I lose it, and you're like, Yo, that's true. Yo. That's actually a really interesting relationship that happens. I'm jealous of that one. Yo. You should be though, for real. Like, <laughs> yeah. I be, I, you should get up in it, man. If you want, like, I want to be part of it. Me. When he's not with you, he loves you. Oh, <laughs> you I want your man in. I want in. Where's your man's at? <laughs> you gotta find out. <laughs> oh, this turned out. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you guys. Thank you. <laughs>